I'm going to go over our um, Akaka Falls the way um, we taught it in class. This is a C6 high G tuning. Um, this arrangement is for six strings, so we're just going to use strings one through six here. Um, I'll, um, I'll walk you through the tablature, which I'll display. In a, a separate uh, shot here. So here we go. Um, string five, the seventh fret, eighth fret, string two, and then uh, it's two and five at the seventh fret. So the technique here is really important. You can slide into this, but you want to kill string five before you hit string two. So you need to slide the bar up. I let my thumb hit string five, and so it gets muted. So, so it's your thumb will do that. Um, pluck string two and five, then two and five t uh, together at the fifth fret. Um, you want to hit string uh, three at the sixth fret. So as you leave string two here. Pull the bar towards you and let your second finger mute it. So it's like that. So you can go. And same thing now. We're going to place, move to the fifth fret, fourth string. So pull the bar off string three so it gets muted. You can't have, otherwise, you're going to get that kind of junk. So then pluck string five at the fifth fret, right? With your thumb, then work your way back up. String four at the fifth fret. Um, working our way back up on my tab, it's uh, this note again. Um, string three, um, sixth fret. And in parentheses, you can add um, the fifth fret on the fifth string and get this nice slant. So it's. to, if you're going to do the slant, you got to do a quick lift to kill string four, otherwise you're going to get that horrible stuff. So it's, then back home to G at seventh fret. Now we're just setting up our transition to the C chord, D minor seventh and G seventh of the chords. Lead into the C chord now, 11th fret I have. And then, uh, here's the melody, um, 12th fret, 2, 3, 5, then 14, 3, 4, 6, 3, 4, 6 on the 12th fret, back up, 14. So it's fret, and here's our E7th, 11th fret, so it's that whole sequence is, um, and repeat that first phrase just like I taught it. Now we go to our E7th, I'm plucking Strings three, four, six. Um, kind of zoom into it from the fifth fret. Three, four, six. Then you can slide into the fourth fret. There's our E7. So it's. I'm muting this at the seventh fret with my thumb. Like that. Real quick. You don't want to just slide through it. You can, but it gets a little bit much. I'm doing a quick lift too, actually, as I do that. Thumb goes down and a little lift, but you want to quiet it. Then we end with our phrase again. That's the whole song. You can cut there.